had the best seat in the house. First exit seat. Look at that. Plenty of room to stretch out here, folks. This bus is cold, so cold. Condensation on the windows. Got yeah, here to uh, see Barna Boom. And other than our bus and a couple bands, it's uh, that's just slow, just slow as it was when I came in here. And again, it's uh, I mean, for me, it's a great time to travel. But it's just, it's just hard to see the economy taking this big of a hit here. I mean, this really, one, one bus. My goodness. So, let me come in here. I wanted to, I wanted to take a note. Okay, so it's 817, and I don't want to take a look again when I get all the way through security. See how long it's going to take me. All right, so here we go. Here's a look at the arrivals board. Rivals. Let's come up here and take a look. Want some boot Pacific again, as usual. So what time is it? See, I'm a little bit early. 11:35, row E. 5J930. You got a few folks. And I read on uh I read on the news that they're still letting people from China come in here. So there's like what 2,000, 3,000 people from China arrive and several hundred from South Korea and like a couple hundred from Italy. I thought they had totally shut it down, but no, they haven't. So you still got Still got uh, Chinese folks coming in here. And you know, I don't even know why I'm hustling over here because, well, maybe it's open. 9, 10, 11, maybe open. And if it's not open, I may go downstairs in the basement and get me some Thai tea. I've done a video before on that. Look at this. Beautiful. Keep heading down to E. Yeah, there was no, there was no real reason for me to be hustling. Try to get here and fight the lines, cause there ain't no lines. Okay. And it's about 50-50 split. People wearing masks, people not wearing masks. 
And I'm one of those that's not wearing a mask. Now this says Cebu Pacific on F, but it told me E, so I'm gonna roll around E. Even with the uh, the virus going on, that is Cebu Pacific. There is a fucking line. Even with even with the virus, there's a line at Cebu Pacific. I'm gonna go to the CR. Well, instead of waiting in that line, I just decided I'd get some fresh air out here. Take one more quick look around. At, uh, just the quietness. But folks, it's always a sad day when you leave Thailand. You know, I, I mean, I'm sad because I left my, my, my babies and the old lady over there, but whenever you leave, leave Thailand, it's a sad day. Probably the only country in the world that when you go to leave, you get sad, you get emotional. I mean, I remember times when, uh, you know, we put each other in the cab leaving fucking Patia and there'd be three grown men crying, tears in their eyes. It's, it's, uh, it's just a slice of paradise here in many ways. There's no place perfect, but I always get emotional when I gotta leave Thailand. Just thought I'd share that with you. All right, well, beautiful day for flying, a few clouds. I'm gonna go back in here and see if the lines died down. One of the problems, one of the problems when you fly Cebu Pacific with my Filipino brethren, they all gotta bring Pasalubon back, right? Especially when they're coming from abroad. So it's like, you know, every Filipino has got like three or four cardboard boxes they're trying to check in. They all, they're loaded down because of the Pasalubon rule. And me, I ain't bringing no Pasalubon. I'm over that. <laughs> Hong Kong, down to Nagoya, Reunion, all those flights are canceled right there. Let me show you right here. Hong Kong, Macau, Shanghai, Jimin, Shanghai, Nagoya, all those are canceled. Not Reunion. Ho Chi Minh City, cancel. Singapore, Hong Kong, Shantou. So they're still showing the flights on the board, but all of them are canceled. Thai Airways, Vientian. But they're still going to Tokyo. Three hour rule. I guess everybody's adhering to that. So they're there three hours early. I'm going to head down, folks. If you haven't seen any of my other videos, you know, the top floor is the departures. And then the second floor, you got your Burger King and your stuff like that. And all the, all the expensive restaurants. Starbucks. Mm -hmm. You know, all your all your foreign food, foreign, your flung food. But I don't recommend that you hang out on this floor. I mean, it's up to you, hell. It, what I'm saying, there's other options. You just got to come down uh, all the way to the basement for a spot to hang out. And then I'll show you where the local food is. Second floor arrivals and come down one more floor. That's all the public transportation over here. Taxis, everything. The local food court, folks, is straight ahead. You got a sign up there that says food court and a convenience store over there. But down here on the on the taxi level, just keep trucking down to the all the way to the end. And it's a nice food court and um, that's where the bus that takes you to patio but what you want to do if you got some time to kill you don't want to hang out with the masses pop on down here to where the airport rail link which is the basement so you come on down here to the basement and it's a coffee shop 7-eleven a couple little restaurants and nobody knows about this place or nobody hangs out here it's always quiet 
and you got the airport hotel and the rail link and folks if you if you're trying to get downtown this rail link is great um the uh the train is nice it's safe easy to get your luggage on and if you're confused about where to go just go to information they speak english they'll show you tell you where to go but you know if it's carrying a ton of luggage I mean, maybe not but here's a look around you got this coffee world cafe but over here is a subway and usually this little spot at the meeting point they get draft beer but there's nobody in there and that's to the rail link and the information booth and you get your tickets to the train down there on the left where they're standing um, and if you get confused just go to information to help you you got ATMs banking down here 7-eleven Thai chef Express let me see if I can get me some Thai tea let me just show you what else is down here in case it's changed up it wasn't that coffee world where I get my tea you got this place here tea and coffee next to a massage spot you got food and everything but I get it right here right where these ladies are standing and for reference it's across from this food and the 7-eleven here and I'm gonna get some uh, uh, China Mian spot and for 40 baht I just asked for the China Mian Cup and Cup, thank you China Mian I had a Thai tea it's like a uh, chai tea with milk it's not the same as you get in, in uh, Starbucks you gotta come to Thailand to get it and China Mian that is some kind of delicious for 40 baht it's more beautiful architecture here at the airport instead of waiting in line you kind of take a little museum tour of so many of these things to see beautiful here in this airport a little bit longer getting through uh cebu pacific air's check-in there's just a lot of people okay i got it so it took a little bit longer than i thought this wasn't a breeze but i made it through you went through security they were obviously taking temperatures and then I got dinged as security for uh, my power bank now they got a rule what is it can't have over 10,000 but my power bank was old so when she goes to look at it it doesn't say it on the back so I had to pull up a uh, picture of it on the internet and show her that you know it was in regulation no big deal going through immigration but you know you got to put your four fingers down on the uh, the electronic scanner so make sure you wash your hands right after you leave immigration and I noticed the immigration officers they had uh, cleaner they were actually cleaning it so shout out to them for doing a great job you know facing I would say thousands but now it's probably hundreds of people every day um, anyhow Made it through the process. And now, the question is, I'm gonna drink me one more Singha before I leave. And the answer, I don't know. The answer is the jury's still out. You guys are awesome. Okay, come over here to Subway on my little table. That's where I always hang out. Oh my goodness. I better to eat now. I never eat plain food. You know, I get to the Philippines and go back to challenging trying to find a good meal. Flying first class. So I've been jet flying with the limousine, riding with any lover. Beautiful day. Check it out. Let me catch right here. Chill in the shade of that wind. <laughs> we are about to close the main cabin door. All ground personnel, please disembark now. Cabin crew, stand by.
crew are tours for departure and cross check. beer for a while but I lie I'm drinking me a root beer Thank you. 